All right, friends, just uh, looking at my, I got my health watch and I'm just looking at my stats here. So this is heart rate for the year. So you can go through the months here. So it's November now. So as you can see, 42, 172, October 37, 173. That's the high heart rate. And then we got the low one at 37, which is pretty good. I only exercise recreationally a couple uh, to three aerobic sessions per week. Work out with weights, just uh, free weights, chin-ups, simple stuff, the basics. Go for a run, you know, nothing serious. But uh, this heart rate that I have here uh, looks pretty consistent, pretty good. Anyways, it always bottoms out at 37. I'm not sure how the hell it gets so low, but it does. You can see here July, high of 182. Uh, this is June. I was in, uh, yeah, so this was a, I went for a run, and I think I got to 185. So the thing is... I live here, the elevation in the valley is, is 3,500 feet, so it's pretty high, probably the second highest city in North America, except for Denver, Denver is higher, but anyways, again, you're living at altitude, so I'm thinking that has something to do with it, so again, you can see here, 37, 185 max for me, same thing, 37, 177, April 37, 182 is the max, so that's not bad. March 37, 169, February 37, 182. I got to show this to my doctor. I go for my physical every two years because I'm an Uber driver. So I didn't show her this, but uh, the consisten consistency I think is good. And here you can see here for the year, resting heart rate average 57 beats per minute. So that's pretty slow. Pretty slow. I'm assuming that this 37 is when I'm sleeping or something like that. So, uh, so anyways, just wanted to make a quick little video uh maybe get some comments see what anybody else thinks and again uh working out consistently my entire life always doing exercise don't smoke don't really drink uh maybe that has something to do with it eat pretty healthy uh every day the breakfast is the same thing uh, you know boiled egg uh, some cut up vegetables uh fruit oranges apples uh and about four or five cups of coffee so not actually about three cups of coffee max so ex exactly the same thing every day. So again, we're going through the uh, month, months here. 37 is the low, and 185, 184 high. 185 was the high for this year. I hit it in June, went for a run. And that was also at elevation, uh, 3,500 feet in the valley. So it's probably about uh, 37 to 4,000 feet above sea level here where I'm doing my exercise. So. I'm thinking this has something to do with it and also the consistency of my my diet and my exercise so anyways guys uh let me let me know what you think i think it's, it's pretty good having a consistent heart rate like this blood pressure so uh, let's just look at that month over month i i didn't take it consistently but uh we get the idea so october i did i think i just did it once but anyways uh we'll look at the history september 111 over 74 that's good um oh average here down here at the bottom uh left hand corner you see average blood pressure for the uh for the month was 112 over 76 i did a 14 times so i took it so the average was 112 over 76 so that's pretty good um august average 112 74 good i did it i took it 13 times so really good and also just want to mention i was sitting in the sun uh before i took my blood pressure so that's as you can see it really keep the uv actually lowers your blood pressure so that's actually good so if you can sit in the sun i didn't uh, think it would do that but uh definitely does so it's uh always consistent here so let's just keep going back um july average i did it 23 times again sitting in the sun 116 over 80 that particular day J july 22nd uh, the average, uh, actually I took it 23 times, so that's actually pretty good. Average was 110.74. Um, pulse was a little higher because I just, I always took my blood pressure when I got in from sitting on the sun in the, on the back deck. So that's good. Um, June, 21 times I took it. Average, 109 over 75, so that's good. Um, so that's awesome. May. 27 times again sitting in the sun 107.73 so a little bit low on the 
the number, but I'm not too worried about that because, like I said, like I, my heart rate goes really super high when I'm exercising, so that's good. It goes like basically four four point five times my resting, so that's a good sign. Knock on wood. Okay, so we got April, twenty one times, one eleven over seventy four was the average, sixty one beats per minute, pulse average, March, one sixteen seventy six. This is also when I was in Florida, so again, lots of sun. February, also in Florida. Uh, resting heart rate, 56, so pretty good. Again, we're at sea level now, so everything's easier. So that's actually really good too. Uh, 21 times I took my blood pressure, 117 over 77, so that's actually right on, right on the money. That's perfect for blood pressure. January, also in Florida. Uh, so here... So it was elevated three times. So the average though was, see, because a couple of weeks I was still up high in the mountains. Uh, and as you can see, it was higher blood pressure that I wasn't in the sun yet. So I, I think I got to Florida, uh, what the hell was it? Um, January 17th or something like that. Anyways, so half the month or a quarter or yeah, two thirds of the month. So again, so it's still not bad. 120 over 82. So this health watch as soon as your blood pressure gets over 82 it, it, it calls it elevated so that really isn't that bad and you can see here for the month average blood pressure was 119 over 84 so a little higher so okay whatever still pretty good though but as you can see just wanted to show you how the blood pressure deal works i did take it quite a few times and uh along with the heart rate so knock on wood that's why i never go see the doctor until I have to do my physical for Uber because every two years you got to get a physical to make sure your eyesight's good and you're still healthy to drive because it's uh, everything's governed by insurance. So that's how that works. So anyway, so the, the watch is actually pretty good to monitor your health. So as long as everything stays consistent over time, uh, I think you're, you know, people are usually pretty healthy if that's the case. Again, knock on wood, let's, every, let's hope everybody stays healthy. Uh, and uh, yeah, so just again, recreational athlete i just stay fit try to stay fit anyways and uh yeah that's about it thanks guys thanks for watching